Welcome to System Test Whatever I'm on. I don't know. It's in the title. Um, so, as we can see, there are quite a few changes on the system. So, but before I get into it, first of all, I have to say, subscribe to Mac and Alpha Five. His YouTube will be in my description. Please go subscribe to him. He is the original designer of the panel. I did put my own twist on it, though. Um, I'm going to have to start saying that now, as I did mod it quite a bit. Um, also, go join my Discord. And also, I think that's everything. Uh, Discord will also be in the description. Anyways, um, so in terms of changes, I did take out the little ammeter. This will probably only be for this test. I rigged up my... Uh, Multimeter, I put it on DC 10 amps. And as we can see, this little green LED is drawing 0 0.008 amps. Not very much. But this will give us a little bit of a better reading of our amperage. I added in two new pole stations. These are the alert alarm for supervisory. Um, I don't have another SCR yet, so it is going to be an auto resetting supervisory. Here's the knack for that. Still have the smoky. Still have the same poles. We have all the same knacks. So, as of right now, this panel is sitting at five devices and four knacks. Or, well, technically it only has one knacks, one knack, but people call notification appliances knacks, even though, you know, whatever. Um, so, anyways, to start us off, I guess we will just uh, make sure our coating is set good. Um, I think about there is good. And then we'll just pull one. It's on constant. My bad. That's that. I have noticed the oscillator circuit itself draws almost 100 amp. Or 100, 1 milliamp. So without the knack, it's, it's how much the oscillator circuit draws. Alright, now we will do supervisory. We will do first the tornado one. Unfortunately, I haven't found my blue LED back yet. Hopefully, I'll find it soon. But, anyways, now we will go turbo speed. And we will do the call point. Okay, now that it's on silence, the lights are way brighter. You can really see it on the incandescent bulb over here. Nice and bright. Really like it. I did the call point that does not need any resetting. So we will turn the silence back on. Now we will do the police supervisory. So basically a supervisory circuit is dead simple. We have our power coming in here, goes into a transistor, 
comes out of the transistor, goes into the horn strobe and the supervisory light. And then our pulse stations, um, we have our IDC disable. So this guy, six volts comes in through the switch and then into this first spring here. So I tapped in to the first spring for these guys. And then this spring goes into the SCR for fire. So I instead hooked it up right here into the um, transistor. So as you can see, if we disable the IDC, nothing works. As these things aren't getting six volts, meaning they can't give six volts for their trigger sources. I also have an active disable. You saw me use that earlier. So anyways, now for the last device, the smoke detector. I did put a bit of tape over the horn and it does make it a lot quieter, which is nice because the point is not to hear that. The point is to hear those. So we will do it now. There we go, reset. Um, we'll slow it down. Or actually, we'll do constant. I, I always forget to change the coding before I do it. We'll do constant. Picks up to almost 800 milliamps, or eight milliamps. Shows up to 800, but technically it's eight milliamps. You can see when the horns are in their off time, that thing gets way brighter. That's pretty fun. Alright. I'll reset the panel. This SCR is stupid, so it's not going to let me. Give me a second, please. Sometimes you just have to let the panel sit in the off state. Anyways, horns will go back on. That guy's on. Yep, okay, so everything's good. We'll do a walk test real quick, and we'll do some manual code 3 on this guy here. So, constant. That's all good. It's coded. So unfortunately, these guys are lights, not strobes, so they do flash along to any coding, kind of like the good old 2903s or whatever they are. Um, anyways, I think that would be about it for the system test. Uh, let's just turn everything on, see how many amps it draws. Be stupid again with oh, 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 it fix itself now. So now I'm gonna take this down before these rubber bands get too stretched out, and we'll take this guy down. This will cut panel power to the panel, so it no longer has a negative track. And we'll put the panel back to normal with this good old feller. This guy goes right here. This guy we're gonna install right there. And this guy. Hard to do one. This is like really hard to do one-handed. So that guy's good. That's all good. I'll tighten that guy back down. Okay, panel is back to normal. Um, hope you liked it. Please subscribe. Also subscribe to Mac Alpha Five. Join Discord. Like, comment, whatever you want to do. I don't really care. Goodbye.